Once upon a time in a small village nestled amidst serene mountains. There lived a renowned Zen master named Master Kajiro. He was known far and wide for his wisdom and ability to bring inner peace to those who sought his guidance. One day, a young man named Koji approached Master Kajiro with a heavy heart. Koji was overwhelmed by the chaos and stress of his daily life and yearned for inner peace. Impressed by Koji's sincerity, Master Kajiro agreed to guide him on the path to tranquility. Master Kajiro and Koji began their journey early one morning, walking along a peaceful riverbank. As they strolled, Master Kajiro started to share his first tip for gaining inner peace. Tip number one, he began, is to embrace the present moment. Let go of worries about the past or anxieties about the future. Be fully present in the here and now. Koji listened attentively, eager to absorb every word of wisdom from the master. As they continued their walk, Master Kajiro revealed the second tip. Tip number two, he said, is to cultivate gratitude. Appreciate the blessings in your life, no matter how small they may seem. Gratitude brings peace to the heart. Koji nodded. Taking note of the second tip, the pair continued their journey, and Master Kajiro shared more pearls of wisdom along the way. Tip number three. Master Kajiro continued, is to practice forgiveness. Holding on to resentments only weighs you down. Let go of grudges and free your mind. Koji felt a weight lift from his shoulders as he contemplated the importance of forgiveness. The duo reached a tranquil garden where butterflies danced amidst blooming flowers. And Master Kajiro spoke again. Tip number four. He said softly, is to find joy in simplicity. Appreciate the beauty of nature. Enjoy small pleasures. And let go of unnecessary material desires. As the sun began to set, casting a warm glow over the surroundings. Master Kajiro shared tip after tip on their journey of self-discovery. Tip number five, he said, is to cultivate a peaceful mind through meditation. Allow your thoughts to settle and experience inner calm. Tip number six is to practice self-care. He went on. Nurture your body, mind, and soul. Eat well, exercise, and indulge in activities that bring you joy. Tip number seven. Master Kajiro continued. Stop thinking about sex. Thinking about sex is perfectly natural. We're hormonal, sexual beings whose genes drive us to procreate. But sometimes, sexual thoughts can become overwhelming. 
making it difficult to focus and difficult to get simple things done. However, it's possible for those urges and desires to become more like background noise as you go through your everyday life. Especially when you should be thinking more about career, education, health, interests and hobbies, family and friends and money. On and on they continued. Exploring various topics from the importance of kindness and compassion to the power of acceptance and letting go. Each tip revealed a new layer of understanding for Koji. Helping him to find his own path to inner peace. Finally, after sharing the twelfth and final tip, Master Kajiro turned to Koji with a serene smile on his face. Remember, he said, achieving inner peace is not an end goal, but a lifelong journey. Embrace these tips, reflect on them, and make them a part of your daily life. Inner peace will follow. Over time, Koji applied each of Master Kajiro's tips, integrating them into his daily routine. Slowly but surely, he found the chaos in his mind fading, replaced by a deep sense of tranquility. The young man discovered that the more he practiced the twelve tips, the more inner peace he experienced. Word of Koji's transformation soon spread throughout the village. People from far and wide sought his guidance. Hoping to learn the twelve powerful tips from the Zen master. And so, with Master Kajiro's wisdom and Koji's newfound understanding, the twelve powerful tips for gaining inner peace continue to touch the hearts and minds of countless individuals, spreading tranquility and harmony throughout the world.